Greetings. In this video, we're going to benchmark the iPad. We're going to benchmark the iPad 3 against the iPad 4. You'll notice the iPad 3 is white. It has the A5 processor inside. The iPad 4 is black and it has the A6 processor inside. Apple in its last keynote said that the processor inside the iPad 4 was two times faster than the prior generation. We're going to find out how much speed or how much that translates into speed when we're working with the application called iMovie. What I'm going to do is use both iPads to encode a simple trailer and we're going to use the spooky house of Shady Lane. I have them both set up the same on both iPads. They are the same project. We're going to hit go at the same time and we'll find out is the A6 really two times faster. Three, two, one, go. On the left, we have the iPad 4 with the A6 processor shown with the black bezel. And on the right, we have the iPad 3 with the A5X processor shown with the white bezel. What we're looking at, at the bottom of the screen, we can see the time. The encoding time elapsed. Time zero is when we hit go. And in the center of each iPad screen is a little white status line. And as that line moves from left to right on both screens, that shows the total completion of the encoding of the movie. If we look at it right now, the iPad 4 does have a little bit of a lead. I wouldn't say it's two times faster. And I know some people are wondering right now, well, how am I recording both iPads? There's an application called Reflections for the Mac or the PC which you can use your Mac or PC as an AirPlay device. So let's look and see. So we're about half done on the iPad 4 and not quite half done on the iPad 3 at about a minute out. But the iPad 4 definitely is not twice as fast as the iPad 3. But remember there's a lot going on with the architecture. It's reading it off the internal flash SSD running it through the CPU, compressing it to a 1080p movie, and then writing it back out to the flash. So depending on the architecture inside, it might not be twice as fast. So it looks like the iPad 4 is just about done and it's checking in at 1 minute 34 seconds to encode the trailer. The iPad 3 is still going and if you look, it's almost done. And I think it's going to check in at about, I would say about 1 minute 50 seconds. Let's see here. So one minute, 53 seconds. So let's do the math and find out how much faster the iPad 4 is when using iMovie than the iPad 3. So the iPad 3 rendered the trailer in 113 seconds and finished second. And the iPad 4 rendered its trailer in 94 seconds. It, it clearly won, but it was only about 16.8% faster when using iMovie encoding at 1080p. So there you have it, the iPad 3 versus the iPad 4.